Rafael Nadal, the tennis player who is known as the King of Clay, a professional tennis player from Spain and the thief of so many tennis fans' hearts. Rafael's moves over the clay look like a miracle, never failing to leave his opponent stressed, but have heard about the amazing family of the man? The Spanish man comes from a family of extra talented people. If you did not know about his family, do not worry, we have got all the important and crispy information about Rafael Nadal's family in this video. So keep watching to know about our favorite tennis player's family, Rafael Nadal's wife. Maria Francisca Perello is the wife of the world's fourth best tennis player. She has been engaged with Rafael for 15 years. Maria and Rafael have a cute love story which can also be called a fairy tale. To those who say love does not last long, their relationship is proof. Maria is the childhood sweetheart of our tennis guy. Sources say that Maria has had a crush on Rafael since they were pretty young. Later, they both got committed and their relationship succeeded with marriage. But wait, Maria's complete identity is not just the wife of Rafael Nadal, but she also has amazing professional and educational background. So let us introduce you to the project's director at Rafael Nadal Foundation, who is none other than Maria Francisca Perello. In her first job, she was a sports marketer in London. Rafael's childhood sweetheart has a cute nickname, Siska. According to her birthplace, Maria is Spanish by birth. Her hometown is in Spain. With regards to religion, she believes in and practices Christianity. Coming to her excellent educational background, she is highly educated and has a degree in business administration. Maria is one of the most popular projects director at Rafael Nadal Foundation of her time. Maria Francisca Perello is an amazing woman. She is a beauty with brains. The woman is talented and also dedicated to her work. Rafael and Maria's fairy tale marriage. Nadal got married in 2019. The Spaniard, who is currently ranked as the world's fourth best tennis player, shared a got married update on Facebook in 2021, which left everyone in shock. As it is widely known that he is married since 2019, the fans were left confused by the update. Since Nadal revealed his marriage after two years, some people were left confused, while the others came up with a few extremely cheeky replies to Nadal's post. Do Rafael and Maria have a baby? A question by many of his fans. After rumors circulated all week about Rafael Nadal and his wife Mary Siska Perello did not plan to have a baby for a long while, which kept his fans upset as they were interested in both the professional and personal lives of their heartthrob. But the good news came out as we got to know that the couple is expecting their first child together. The tennis star finally confirmed the news on Friday, 17th June, that Nadal will officially be a father. If all goes well, I'm going to be a father, Nadal said via Sky Sports. The couple who married in 2019 decided to keep their exciting news secret from the world for a while. However, the Spanish publication Hola released the news early at the beginning of the week. Nadal's reasoning for keeping the news a secret at first was because of the fact that he likes to keep his personal life private, just like many other athletes out there. I'm already exposed enough in my professional life. My loved ones and I like to live with a low profile, Nadal said about keeping the good news a secret. Let's understand our wonderful tennis player's feelings and wish for the couple to have a healthy baby. Rafael's father Sebastian Nadal is the father of Rafael Nadal, a businessman by profession. Sebastian is a real businessman by profession. He runs multiple firms which include an insurance company, window and a glass company at Vidres Mallorca. He is also the owner of one popular restaurant, Sapunta. Whenever his son Rafael has some time, he likes to pay a visit to that restaurant and spend some quality time over there. He enjoys the mood in there. This also shows the healthy relationship between the father and the son. Rafael's mother. Anna Maria is the mother of the clay goat. His mother and he has a loving relationship. She has always supported him with his dreams. Anna Maria has always been by her son's side, even after the day she got discovered with Sebastian Nadal. With regards to the earnings of the pretty lady, her net worth is currently unavailable, but it is well known that Anna Maria lives in luxurious life, which is all thanks to her son's wealth. Nadal's worth is over $300 million. Anna Maria and Sebastian Nadal Divorce always sounds upsetting, but everybody has the freedom to live their lives in their ways and in the ways they think are better for them. Sebastian Nadal and Anna Maria Pereira were married to each other. The couple was blessed to have two kids, Rafael and Maria Isabel. There are not many details about the relationship of Nadal's parents, like when they married and how they met. As Nadal already said that his family prefers to live their lives in a very private manner, but if stories are to be believed, then the couple got divorced in the year 2009. They spent more than 40 years together. 
Unfortunately, the pair chose to part their lives. However, the reason for their split is still not known. Raphael's sister Maria Isabel Nadal is the sister of Raphael Nadal. Nadal has always been known to be the family-centric person. He prioritizes his family and loves to spend time around them. Although he loves and cherishes every member of his family, he shares a very special bond with his sister. Although Maria likes to stay away from the limelight, we have some interesting facts about her that you would love to know. Maria has always been a good sister. She supported her brother at every point in life. She has also played an important role in his brother's marriage. Maria Isabel Nadal is three years younger than her brother as she was born in 1989. She lived away from the family for a few years but shared a close bond with her family. She also shared the same apartment with Raphael for a while. The special bond between the brother and sister can be understood by Maria's statements in a few interviews. Once in an interview, Maria said, He's always urged me to come along when he goes out with his friends. It's natural to us, even if others might sometimes find it strange. It's part of the secret of our special bond. Her statement over here shows the love bond they share. Maria also never fails to praise Nadal for his role in her life and for being a good brother as she says in an interview, most boys growing up see their younger sisters as irritations, especially when they are teenagers, but that has never been the way Raphael has treated me. Raphael's sister, after completing her studies, carried out various jobs as she did not want to take advantage of her family's position. She joined a sports management company for work. She also worked with IMG. Raphael's family also has two uncles and a grandmother. Tony Nadal, who played an extremely important role in Nadal's life, is a famous Spanish tennis coach. Tony Nadal is not just Rafael Nadal's uncle, but he is also Rafael's ex-coach. He has coached Rafael since he was young, and there is no question that Rafael's skills have the hard work of his uncle. He also has a younger brother, Miguel Angel Nadal. Miguel Angel Nadal Homar is a retired footballer from Spain who played as a defender and midfielder. He started and ended his career as a footballer with Mallorca, but his greatest achievements came whilst at Barcelona during the Dream Team era. He won numerous domestic and continental titles in the Dream Team era. The two uncles of our young player are also as amazing as the rest of the family, but we are not done yet. Raphael also has a grandmother whom he loves and cherishes a lot. Raphael's grandmother is Isabel Homar. She is a sweet and beautiful lady. Raphael loves his family a lot, and he gets a lot of support from them. This was all about the man's family background from our side. If you know any other facts about this amazing person, please share them with us in the comments below. Also, do not forget to share this lovely and amazing information with your friends and family. As you have come so far with us, why don't you hit that like button? Please subscribe to our channel for more such amazing content and do hit the notifications bell so that you do not miss any of such amazing videos. We will meet you in another video with some really cool content. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.